Today is the most special day of all time because Nicholas Light TV catches up to Attack on Titan. I'm gonna catch up to the very first anime I started watching. There's nothing more important than this day. The episode is called The Dawn of Humanity. Literally, today is the dawn of humanity because I'm reacting to it. It's been a long road. And for those that have joined me on this historic journey, I thank you from the bottom of my non-existent heart. All right, you cocks. Let's get to The Dawn of humanity when you start with a bird oh my god they're doing the credits in the beginning would he take a break from the rumbling Aaron's in a suit is he on a lunch break <laughs> All right, so that was officially one of the most beautiful intros. I don't know what's going on. This has to be a flashback. This is so weird. Oh, no. Oh. So this is how we're going to end it. Oh my god, they're going beyond the walls for the first time. This had to be between episode 3 and 4. Oh, no! Oh, oh, oh! Nah, this is like every fan- Oh my god, this is a fan fiction. I've read some dirty stories about Attack on Titan, and this is exactly what people fantasize about. I can't believe this is real, what we're watching right now. He doesn't look like a mummy. This is- this is pre- Zeke opening his entire body. Look how happy they are. Why couldn't life be like this? Oh my god, the way it fades into it. What is this? Are we gonna see every square dance? Gonna see every dude in the Macarena. Oh my god. Oh, I can't. oh my god, there's a camera. I feel like them. Azamoto. Oh, I, I keep thinking his name is Azumabito, man. That, 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 that's my man's um, onion. Take your time. Stroll through it. Because before you know it, this place is going to be a fucking footprint. Oh, he ain't smiling anymore. <laughs> I can't believe what I'm... There's a car! <laughs> Dude, I feel like them. As if I've never seen a car before. It's a cow! Oh, oh my god. Nah, this is, this is going to be too much for my little heart, man. Oh, fuck. They're like, let's not draw any attention. But at the same time, we're gonna yell at the car. <laughs> oh, no. look, look at the size difference! <laughs> Levi is an elf! Mikasa? Oh my god. With her little bow? And there's Eren, that piece of shit. Look at him, want to stay close to each other. Look at innocent little Aaron before he had the vision. I miss innocent Aaron. Stupid Aaron. <laughs> Levi with his hat. I can't believe this. I never thought I'd see them with hats on. No. Oh my god. She's eating white stuff. What are you doing to me? <laughs> This is flipping cold, she said. There's that country accent. <laughs> this lollipop's in a clown. What, what is this show? Does that look like a devil to you? Maybe that does. But hello, bring me to hell. Hmm. Oh! <laughs> Levi's afraid of clowns! You, you fucking perv. Get away from me. Yes, Sasha, stuff your stomach. Oh! <laughs> Aaron is eating ice cream. Eat it. No, fuck your dad's memories. This isn't the time to think about Eldia and the founding time. Eat the fucking ice cream. They noticed him starting to lose himself in his his memories. Oh my god. Oh no. Let the kids steal. He's gonna get stoned. I don't know what they do in these times. Smash his hands! No, you don't! Why are you all men? Why is it all men? You look like you're doing just fine with that outfit. Levi is so small. 
but he could fuck up every single person here, bro. Girls are like, I want a guy that's six foot tall or higher. Anything below that is ugly. Yeah, that's until you get six foot or higher. And that's the only thing big about them. <laughs> you know what I mean? His sister. Oh my god, they protected the kid. Hanji's wearing glasses over her eye patch. This is so interesting to see them beyond the walls before all of this rumbling bullshit happens. Look at them as a group, as they should be. Oh. Wait, was that like a little thing of Eren seeing that these towns above the walls or beyond the walls are just like the walls? Like, they're basically all that is saying there's good and there's bad people. It's just, like, within the walls. So is he having, like, an internal conflict right there? Or is he saying, you know what, this place is shit. I'm gonna destroy it. This is gonna be the, foot f the first footprint on my rumbling body. I love when they play this music. Bring it back for the final season, the final part. I can't believe what I'm looking at right now. This picture is the reason for my depression. Hmm... Man, I forgot about Historia. Oh my god, I thought Historia was history. Look at that bonsai tree in the back, man. I need one of those. Oh my god, like, there's so much going on in every scene in this season. In, in, in every episode of this show, but especially this season. Just the color grading, the animation the the shadowing everything you got to appreciate how much time and effort these animators put into it and i'm joking around when i mention the whole cg shit i understand they have to use it every now and then especially on a design as complicated as reiner's but wow you got to give them credit where it's due man they are fucking incredible at what they do absolutely incredible too late for that aaron has his own plan it's so sad man Mm. This is when they had hope. They were all together. And, oh, bro, that, my God. <laughs> this dude walked out. He said, y'all do what you want to do. I already had the whole rumbling layout in my head. あなたは家族。You fucking creep. You just ruined the I've been waiting for that moment the entire show. Do they look like they're getting married? Aaron asked, look at her getting nervous and all shy and all cute, not knowing how to answer him. Aaron taking charge, he's like, when am I to you, Mikasa, baby girl? <laughs> oh, what is this, bro? Him crying, looking at the people living in those camps because of war. War! War! They were living in war, and their, their homes got destroyed. And he's seeing, like, the relations... That, uh, how, how similar it is to where he's from. You motherfucker. You, you ruined it. What is that? Better be tequila. I better... The fuck? Where are the subtitles? Oh my god, he's speaking in his... They made up an own language for Attack on Titan. That was so cool. This is really the end. This is fucking beautiful, man. What are you doing to me? I love shit like this. Ah! Dude, no! Oh. 
I was looking at the comments. Waited two weeks for a flashback episode. You entitled prick. I, I don't care if the whole season was a flashback. This is incredible. Seeing Aaron like his last sight of happiness. The last time he smiled was probably this night. That's the importance of this episode. Showing you them before the rumbling happened. And now the rumbling's finally gonna happen. You're gonna see that transformation between Aaron's last laugh to Aaron being the last laugh. Oh my god. Just this alone. Oh my god. What are you doing to me, man? I'm telling y'all, man. People complaining that this was the flashback episode. Are you serious, bro? I'm fucking dying over here. I prefer this shit over action. And I love action. I always make that clear. Sasha's throwing up in the back. The music this episode? I I'm gonna cry. Wish a fucking bomb dropped on this place. Oh wait, no, 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 no bombs. No. First, let them get out of there first. That's so cool how they're attending this meeting from the outside. Clap! Join the crowd! Aaron's walking out of every room! He just walked out? Oh my god, that's when he realized he was like, this world? Fucking asked for it. Wow, so that was really Aaron's last night as Aaron Yeager. I'm in love with you, Aaron. Can I become Mikasa Yeager now? Are we gonna see what Aaron looks like? A and the Titan swimming or some shit? I gotta see what Aaron looks like. They gotta show that. No! Learning how it all came together? How how do people not love this episode? Are you fucking serious? Is either Tatakai or run away? Doesn't Eren look like Mikasa there? Look at that shot. It kinda looks like Mikasa there. You sure they aren't siblings? She used the M word. Holy mother of fuck. Look at these shots. I won't let kids eat their parents anymore. What kind of sentence is that? Mm, Historia. Look at him. He's, he's emotionalist. The baseball. Mm. <laughs> this is why he's like that. He's like, I have four years to live. You know, I'm I'm just gonna fuck the entire world in the ass. And, and who cares? Because I'm gonna die anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Let me just do something that, that will benefit the world at this point, because that's what I was born to do. It's like him knowing he's dying in four years kind of ripped the heart out of him, and now he's just like a he's like a robot following orders or something. His own order. His, his, his What he believes is his destiny. That's how I perceive it. No! Oh! They oh Aaron the fucking voice actor Oh my god it all makes sense it all it all makes sense, man. It, it, it's like, it, it was, it's so easy to understand to live and be happy. And he thinks that this is the way. That's why he's pushing everyone away. He's making people hate him like Mikasa. He's making all of these people hate him because he knows that he's dying in a few years and he just wants the world to be a better place. This is what he believes. I feel like we're going to have a very, very, very emotional scene with Eren and Mikasa and the group again, explaining to each other how they really feel. The, oh my god, man. It's like he believes this is the way.
in his mind this is right he loves them he didn't lose his heart he's putting his heart first Oh, oh my god, wait a minute. There's, a, there's fucking two minutes left. Oh no, it's gonna continue in the next season! <laughs> oh shit. Y'all are gonna make me wait another fucking season? I have to wait? I have to be a peasant like y'all and wait? I'm used to watching episode to episode. Swimming! I was joking! They're fu- they're, they're doggy paddling! That is the weirdest shit I've ever seen. How did they know how to fucking swim? That is the scariest shit I've ever seen, man! Is this gonna be the whole next season? I can't control my fucking body, man! What the fuck? Oh my god! Oh, we gotta see Aaron. It has to end with a, a shot of Aaron. I gotta see what his face looks like. Look at this! This is next season. This is what the next season's gonna be like. Why was the, the, the intro called the rumbling if the rumbling doesn't happen till next season? Oh my god, they brought the song back! <laughs> I listen to this shit every day! We're gonna have to wait until next year to see this town be destroyed. This is the end. This is so fucking amazing. Oh, oh my god, wait a minute, wait a minute. Holy shit, he's that big. What the fuck is that? What is <laughs> I don't know how to react. <laughs> yeah, so I'm going to make a video that summarizes how I feel about this show. From first episode until now, how I feel, I'm going to rank the seasons, my favorite moments, what I don't like, what I love, everything. I'm going to make a big ass video about that. Even though there's another season left, we're going to do that because we have time before the final season, the final part, part one begins. Oh my God. Like, this episode itself was just so incredible because it showed you how we how we got to the first episode of season four, but we're showing that in the last episode comes full circle. We're understanding everything. And I love how I thought the rumbling was going to begin this season, but it really begins next season, the final season, part one, two, three, whatever it's called, and we're going to see destruction, I hope. I fucking hope. This better be some Kaiju Godzilla shit. I'm waiting, man. I want to see destruction, devastation, and death. It makes me sound evil, but I love my, my destruction and shit, man. Especially in this show. I got to see this. We got the last scene. I want to see, like, Mikasa and Eren just talking to each other. Coming to an understanding. Like, Eren is doing this for them. And it's so easy to think that. I don't know why I didn't think that. I guess I had to hear it from his mouth himself to really believe it. But he's doing this for them. At least he thinks this is benefiting them, but it's not. How could they live knowing what just happened? They'd rather die than to live like that. But he doesn't know that. He's blinded by this by this rage and what he believes is right. All of that knowledge. All of that knowledge could only a human could only handle so much. So it's like all of that knowledge and memories and what people want him to do and what he's been through and what he wants best for his family and his friends, that's all in his mind right now, making him act this way. And you can't hate him, but at the same time, you know, like dictators in real life have that ideology where they're like, what I'm doing is right, it's for the benefit of people or whatever. Can't really fully be on his side because he's fucking gen it's mass genocide, bro. But still, I don't know. It it it's, it's such a question, bro. How do you feel? How do you guys feel about what Aaron is doing? Like, how do you honestly feel? You can't 100% be on his side. If you are, I don't know. I mean, you could agree with it. You could be like, I would do the same thing. But do you fully agree with that shit? Like, are you like, yeah, man, that's that's perfectly fine. Man, genocide. They asked for it. Anyways, 
yeah, like I said, a big video is coming next week or this mo next month, whatever, about me talking about this show and how I felt about it. But yeah, guys, that's it. Thank you for joining me on this 89 episode journey or 87 episode journey. Can't wait. I can't wait for next season. The last season, as I was told. Knowing this show, there's probably no last season. It's just going to keep on going. But I think the next one is actually the end. So I'll see y'all in the end.